Hello, and welcome to Our Amazing Kids. I'm your host, Tony Beverly, and with me today is... Ian. Ian. Ian, what you here to tell me about? Flipping. Flipping? You mean like flipping the bottle of water? No, like actually back flipping, front flips, but I'm not going to do Gymnastics. that. Gymnastics? Yes. Ah, I see. So how, uh, what grade are you in? Seventh. And you're how old? I am 12. 12. I was 12 once. Uh, so what got you into this? Um, I saw a couple of people do it on videos on the internet, and I thought, you know, that's cool. And then I started going to the beach with my friend, and then like I was like, why not? So I tried to do a backflip, and I almost landed it. And so basically I just tried all summer long until I finally got it, and now I'm able to do it. Oh, yeah? Do you do it, like, for a team or? Uh... No. Just for the fun of it. You just like to flip. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's fun. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> that's, that, I don't know why that sounds so uh, just unusual to me. I like to flip, but that's fun. cool. <laughs> so how long you been, when did this start? This just started about like two years ago. Oh, so you should be pretty good by now. Yeah. Ah, cool, cool. Well, um, I'd like to get it straight right now. I'm not a flipper. <laughs> uh, I've fallen down. Does that count? Sure. Okay, then I'm a partial flipper. <laughs> so, uh, have you thought about like becoming a gymnast or anything like that? Um, a or couple you, of times, yeah, I've been interested. You just like the flipping part, not yeah. the rest of it. Yeah, basically. Cool. Cool. So, do you just like flip around the house? Not really. <laughs> I, I do it occasionally now. I imagine your mother has uh, prevented all indoor flipping. Not really. <laughs> I also do it every once in a while. Well, uh, that's really kind of, this is kind of unusual. We've had people talk about snakes and insects and chickens and this, that, and the other, but someone who likes to flip is, just strikes me as very unusual and very unique. That's pretty cool. So, um, at some point today, we're going to have you flip for me, but you're not going to teach me how to flip. Okay. <laughs> not a, this is only a half hour show. Okay. <laughs> so do you have other friends that are interested in the same thing? Um, I have a couple of them, but like, they don't do it as often. Yeah. And they haven't like professionally learned how to do it. They don't like practice like... They haven't practiced as much as I have. Yeah, I can just imagine your mom saying, Ian, take the garbage <laughs> out, and you flip it out to the garbage <laughs> can and flip it back in. You're, you're not that bad. No. <laughs> so you just decided one day it's fun to flip. I want to try to flip, and then when you did it, you found it was fun. Yeah, it was, it was really fun. Wow. That's pretty, that's pretty strange. I don't want to say strange. It's just unusual. But it's it's very cool. And yeah. I imagine it's good exercise, good for oh, your yeah. upper body and all that. So how many different ways do you flip? I can flip a couple of ways, but like in this little area, I could probably do it like one way or two. Yeah, yeah. Two so, types. So I've seen like cheerleaders and all that. They do handsprings. Yeah, I can do a handspring. Yeah. And stuff. And I'm all self-taught. So. Yeah. Wow. That's pretty cool. Uh, I can't imagine. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I've always been out of shape, so. Uh, yeah. But that, that's pretty cool that you do that. Uh, and it could lead to some sort of um, athletic endeavor. Yeah. That's that's very cool. We're going to take a break and get Ian's mic off so he can show us how he can flip. Looking forward to it. Be right back. And we're back. Well, my man Ian is going to show us a flip or two right here in the studio. Wow. Wow, that's incredible. Okay, man, I got to tell you, I am 
thoroughly impressed <laughs> to be just standing there and then all of a sudden you flip over. Uh, I noticed that when you flip yourself, you kind of slap your legs. Why is that? All right, it helps you get through the air faster because when you put yourself in a ball, it helps you get through the air. And it's, it's called rotating and you rotate over and when you tuck and you make yourself a smaller center of gravity, you have a better time getting over. Wow. There's a couple times there I just knew you were going to land on your head. It's, it's just amazing just to sit here two or three feet away from you and see that. So if you were to like, if you had a younger friend or a smaller friend who said, oh, I want to learn how to flip, how would you tell them to start so they don't land on their head when they're practicing? Um, first, I'd get into a safe environment like sand or a trampoline. I started off on a trampoline when I was pretty young, and um, it just went off from there. Like, I'd tell them to practice and make sure an adult's around so even if you do get hurt or something, you know, someone's there for you, but um, just I tell them to go out and sand and um, make sure you know how to do it before you actually try. Right. Like, make sure you can get over, make sure you can, make sure you have that confidence. So what about you personally? Have you ever, like, not yeah, rotated enough? Oh, yeah, plenty of times. Yeah. <laughs> And you still do it. Yeah. No broken neck. Glad to see that. Give me a high five on that. <laughs> I always like my guests to not have a broken neck. Yeah, that's the best time to go. That's the best time to go. So, okay, so like I'm just, I've, it's, it's so much different watching on TV. You see somebody do a flip or a handstand or all that, but to actually be just a few feet away from you, you can see that it, it, it it not only takes courage, but strength. Yeah, it's more of my arm like moving up, which is pulling me to go backwards. And like I said, with the, the rotating, like slapping your knees to get over, it all helps. Well, I, okay, okay, I've, I've calmed down a little bit <laughs> <laughs> because that was really impressive. I, and that's the only thing I can say. I mean, this is our amazing kids. And to me, what I just saw was amazing. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. I'd like to see you in the Olympics someday. Maybe. <laughs> cool. Okay. Well, there you have it. We've seen flipping done at a professional level by my man Ian. And he's one of our amazing kids. Cool, man. I appreciate you coming and showing me what you can do. And I'm going to go home and practice. And we'll come back well, next year. <laughs> All right. Thanks for joining us. Come back soon. Bye-bye.